Hey everybody, this is Lauren from Trash is for Tossers and today I'm going to show you how to make zero waste deodorant. Now this recipe has been a really long time coming and that's because there are about five trillion different kinds of deodorant out there. And so one that might work for one person might not work for another. So I'm gonna show you the recipe that works well for me with the disclaimer that if it doesn't work for you, please don't give up on natural deodorants. I had to try a bunch of different recipes before finding the right one for me. My deodorant recipe isn't an antiperspirant, but it does eliminate body odor and works really, really well. It's free of chemical elements like aluminum, which have been linked to cancer and Alzheimer's, propylene glycol, which can damage the central nervous system, and parabens. And with parabens, just look it up because I can't even. This deodorant is cost effective and only takes a few minutes to make. All we have to do is combine a few simple ingredients in a double boiler. So we're going to add two tablespoons of arrowroot powder, one tablespoon of baking soda, one tablespoon of coconut oil, and one tablespoon of shea butter. And now we'll melt them all over a double boiler. Now that our deodorant is melted, we add our essential oils. So I'm gonna add five to 10 drops of my favorite essential oil for deodorant, which is lemongrass. And now we're just going to combine everything together with a little mix. And now I'm going to pour it into a mason jar with a leak proof lid in case you wanna take it on the go or when you travel. Now that we have everything in our mason jar, we're just gonna put it into the fridge for about 20 minutes until it all hardens up and cools, and then you're ready to go. And so to put it on, all I do is take my finger, put a little bit on, and smear it under my armpits, and then I reapply as necessary. Like I said before, everybody's body is different, and so what might work for me might not work for you. And so if you use this deodorant and find that you're still a little bit stinky, you can use this one as a base to tinker with the ingredients and the oils until you find something that's perfect for you. For more zero waste tips, check out the videos on my YouTube channel or head to my blog, trashesfortossers.com.